on any personal experiences to understand his motivation for stepping over that threshold? Um, not directly, and if I did, I wouldn't tell you. <laughs> but but I, 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 only in the sort of universal human sense of, you know, you can empathize with people who have, a, who we all have fear, and we all have reservations, and we all have um, places that we're scared to go, you know, whether they're internal or whether they're external. Um, so I mean, it's some, certainly something I can relate to. I mean, that's part, part of your job as an actor is just to be relatable to things anyway. Um, and I guess, yeah, beyond that, part of it is just casting. You know, I, I didn't cast myself in it, so, you know, whatever they saw, they saw, um, that's they. Um, uh, thank you. Um, was, you know, they thought would be helpful for me to play Bilbo, but I, I, no, it was, it was more kind of, it's, I, I'm a big believer in knowing what play you're in, you know, and in this play I have to sort of be in a way the eyes and ears of the audience, you know, because I'm the nearest thing to an audience member that, that there is in the, in the film, really. Um, I think Bilbo has to be relatable to, has to be empathetic, and um, so my job partly is to relay that by just being open and just being, having a certain vulnerability, having a certain wit and a certain lightness of touch. It can't be too heavy, it can't be too riven with anything. Um, so, yeah, I mean, I just turn up. <laughs> well, you guys, thank you. Oh, I'm sorry, did you want to say one more thing? No, I'm just saying thank you. Oh, oh right then. <laughs> sorry.